In this video, I will be showing you how to install a Velux manual blind. Whilst Velux also have a video showing you this, it's a little vague in detail and the instructions you get in the Velux blind box are lacking any English. Hopefully, this video will help. Your new Velux blind will look something like this in its box. OK, let's open it. Inside the box, you will find the following components. Two side runner trims, normally silver or white. The choice is yours when you order the blind initially. The roller blind and incorporated top trim. A fixing kit, complete with screws and a screwdriver, which is a nice touch. And an instruction manual. Now it's always a good idea to sit down and have a read of this before you get started. This pack is a conversion kit. Now just a quick word about this conversion kit. It's only used if you have an old Velux window that does not have these clips built into it for manufacture, as all new Velux windows do. It can also be used on some non-Velux branded windows in order for you to use the original Velux blind kit on them. But I have to say, in most cases, you will not need this part of the kit. Here are the tabs or clips that I'm talking about at the top of the window. I've highlighted it a little so that you can see it better. Now pick up the integral blind and top trim unit. Do not take anything off it at this stage. Simply push it onto the window clips shown in the picture. And here, inset is the picture that they show in the manual. Now click it into place on the left and on the right. Next we need to snap apart the two bottom clips for the blind to fix to. Just snap it free from the connecting plastic. If you look closely on the underside of the clips, they are labelled left and right with a little L and R. I've highlighted them here so you can see them better. Fix them in place with a screw and a screwdriver from the fixing pack. Please note it's screwed to the window unit and not the window frame. When in place, it should look like this. Notice it fits flush to the bottom and side whilst the little hooked bit of plastic kisses up to the underneath tightly like this. Now do the opposite side exactly the same. And next we'll be fitting the two side trim runners. These simply slide into position and onto the metal tab. Please refer to the pictures in the manual at this stage. Make sure that you don't trap anything that you shouldn't or cut the guide wire. And here it is pushed into position, ready for the bottom of the trim to be clipped in. The bottom of the trim pushes upwards between the window cheek and the plastic clip. It should then snap into place as pictured inset. Take out the remaining screws and making sure that you gently push the trims up to the underneath of the window Screw them in place with the remaining screws from the pack. Here is the trim runner complete. Now just do exactly the same thing for the other side. Now unclip the plastic reel from its holder and unwind. Then remove the guide wire from the reel. The guide wire clip snaps into the other plastic clip like this. Make sure that the string is inside the large channel shown here and then do exactly the same for the other side. Now remove the large plastic clip by pulling the bottom grab tag out and away to the side. Sometimes they can be a little bit tricky. Try doing it all as one motion. This is what the clip looks like when it's freshly removed. And once you've done this, you can do the other side. Your new Velux blind is now complete. The blind pictured is a standard manual blackout blind. There we are, done.